Okay, well, Nikki, you showed us inside a very unique shipping container uh, earlier in the show. It was a home. Let's take a peek at how the owner is using this small space. Up on the third floor is the sleeping quarters. Behind me, we have two bedrooms and a bathroom for the kids, but I'm going to take you to the master suite, which includes the third container. The tub will be here. The shower will be here. One of the issues we faced was how to bring light into the room. Right. Right? We, the innovation was to put in this skylight over the tub and a skylight over the shower. And we took advantage of the window that's over there to put an additional window here to bring diffuse light into the room. Right. And I'm standing where the sink is going to be. Exactly. And across you have this extra storage space. Exactly. And around the corner? There's the throne. Okay. <laughs> so you're a father of five, is that right? I'm a father of five girls. Oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> so you needed a space for yourself. Exactly. When we were designing it, we decided a third floor with a lot, two thirds of the structure to our master bedroom. Rightfully so. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> so this area, we have a, a fireplace, right? This is we have a little lounge here where we can chill. Um, a second escape. Space. Exactly. You know, private staircase, as you might call it. Right. Um, and this area now, we transitioned into the bedroom, mm -hmm. right, which is the, actually the third floor container will be our bedroom. We decided when we were building it to the, put, keep the ceiling height, right? So we insulated from the top down. Okay. Right, so as to keep the metal detail in the room. So this is gonna be the only place where you actually see the container You're, from the exactly. inside. Okay. Right, so we'll keep, we'll insulate the walls in a conventional manner, right? And uh, keep this metal detail, so. Yeah. And then over here? And this will be our little step down yoga nook where we'll stretch in the morning. Right? Okay, and a good. private balcony. And another private balcony. I love this. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> We're up on the rooftop axis, and as you can see, there's not much out here, but once this is done, it's going to be a beautiful rooftop patio. Yeah. You can see the homeowner has incorporated three containers, shipping containers, into his home. And so together, all three of them are 480 square feet. So it's going to be not a ton of space, but combined with the fact that he's actually building a house around right. it, it's going to be beautiful. Oh, You've yes. got to show the final uh, of that.